shit out of all of them. Man, hey, listen. That was the craziest shit. That's what people, everybody overlooking the fact that nigga ludicrous. Nigga, he responded with a rap song. That lets you know how fucked up this shit is. Nigga, if you say I've been at a gay party getting fame, I ain't finna make you no song, nigga. I'm finna call you a motherfucking lie. Why you nigga call that? Nigga, I'm gonna call you on your phone, nigga. You lying. You ain't seen me in no motherfucking That nigga made a rap. That nigga responded with a jingle. <laughs> say, that lets you know he guilty. Nigga come back with a rap song. A hell of a rap song. Nigga ain't rapped in 20 some years. This nigga ain't made a rap song in 20 years. Soon as Cat Williams say, hey, I seen you coming out that that, that, that funny room, though, nigga. <laughs> With walking bow-legged, you, 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 you were not needed before you went in. You died and rub together. You come out of that bow-legged. That boy say, say, now he gonna make a song. I ain't never was ever on my mind. That, I ain't, that nigga went and made a commercial jingle to respond to Cat Williams instead of saying you a goddamn lie. That's how, that's how you call That's how you tell a nigga he lying. You don't go right no bar 16 bar for no nigga. You get on the airwaves and say he lying, baby. Ain't never, mother ain't never seen me coming out there and play walking bow legged. <laughs> say, boy. <laughs> hey, bro. Say, I'll, hey, the thing, because ain't nobody came out and called him a motherfucking lie. Trick daddy, the only one say, I kick your ass, nigga. I'm a street nigga. Rest of them been. They been talking circles. <laughs> That's why I told you I only want five million. And I don't want to make too many white friends. Cause that shit come from making white friends. Yeah, 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 yeah. Quincy, Quincy Jones them was the last nigga. And Dr. Dre and them and did it. They the last nigga to be fucking them boys. The rest of that shit come from them white folks. I'm gonna be on them white folks stages. <laughs> I'm gonna keep getting hit in the head with, with guns at the barber shop. And, and throwing uh, flower pots at niggas. <laughs> this is much safer than getting your shit around. <laughs> Fuck around, find out nigga got a big dick and all the white boy got to suck your dick. <laughs> Did you want to be in this movie, don't you, Charles? <laughs> yeah, I heard you got a, I heard you got a lumberjack. <laughs> who told you that? Harry. Uh, how, who told Harry? Puffy. Who told Puffy? Usher. Who told Usher? <laughs> Somebody, <laughs> that fat girl that he gave herpes to, that fat girl was lying on that nigga when she said herpes or her, she gave her herpes. That nigga got a fat girl fetish, he danced too good. Yeah, nigga danced too well not to have a fat girl fetish. Press that subscribe button and stay tuned for more on Likeable Dialogue.